people to meet COVID-19 directives is causing a president, uh, residential rehab facility in northwest Arkansas to shut its stores. Our Jesse Pierre spoke to the program director who says he's worried this will lead some clients to relapse. Well, we had to put a lot of people out. A lot of people that need services that weren't finished with their recovery and ready to go to their next step. Owned by Quapa House, Decision Point, a substance abuse facility for residential and outpatient treatment care in Bentonville, is closing after facing several financial challenges. Program coordinator Paul Bay says the coronavirus pandemic just took them over the edge. Uh, the state put directives on us of one staff per every 10 clients. There wasn't enough staff to have a safe environment to meet the requirements that the state set forth. Regional detox specialist Keisha Phillips says her and several employees have also not been paid by Quapa House in weeks. We hung on as long as we could and we stayed till the, till the very end. Um, of course, we've all had to go file for unemployment now. The rooms have been emptied and a total of 27 adults receiving inpatient care have been transferred to other facilities. People coming in for treatments were referred to other centers with hopes they continue with their programs. To either be just starting their program or be in the middle of their program and then to find out that they're going to be discharged and with an uncertain future, um, I would imagine a lot of them will relapse. We need this place here. We need this place in our community. Um, we want to help people get better. And um, we have a wonderful team here that is ready to go back and get out there. Bay says they are looking for funding to one day reopen the facility. We reached out to Quapa House for comments but have not heard back yet. In Bentonville, Jesse Pierre, KNWA Northwest Arkansas News.